Utah's on the clock. Here's the commissioner with that pick. Apparently the commissioner playing peekaboo with us. So Utah is, there's the commissioner. Oh, you rascal, you. Dan, I was sitting in the back listening to your pithy comments. <laughs> wondering when you might have something nice to say about one of our draft picks. I always liked Commissioner Tagliabue better than you. <laughs> <laughs> With the 14th pick in the 2006 NBA draft, the Utah Jazz select Ronnie Brewer from the University of Arkansas. His father, Ron, a member of the triplets at Arkansas, much of the final four, Sidney Moncrief, Marvin Dell, played eight years in the NBA. In fact, seventh overall by Portland back in 1978, only the second Arkansas player drafted in the last 10 years, Joe Johnson, 10th overall back in 2001. So Ronnie Brewer going to the Utah Jazz. Let's go to Mark Jones standing by with his dad, Ronnie Senior. Dad, you had an eight-year career, drafted seventh overall by Portland back in the day. What's the one best piece of advice you gave your son? Well, I told him this is going to be a very tough job, you know, and it's a growing experience for him. And uh, day by day, it's a learning experience. And I think that he will end up being a really good pro out there. But uh, the thing about it is it's, it's, it's a chore, and he, he got to make sure he maintains his responsibility. You were rather protective during the recruitment process uh, when representatives were going through the process to talk to your son. Why was that? Well, you know, I, I know how important it is because I think it's a lifelong uh, decision that you have to make, and we want to make sure that that decision was made properly for Ronnie. All right, congratulations. Dan, back to you. All right, thank you, Jonesy. He's a good scorer, but not necessarily a good shooter, Jay. No, he doesn't have a, he doesn't have a great stroke, but it's repeatable. He broke his arm when he was a kid, so he can't really get sort of the classic form on his shot but Ronnie Brewer is a scorer he's a top flight athlete I think he's a very good defender has the potential to be a good defender he's very disruptive he gets steals but he gambles a lot I think defensively he's got to get a little bit more discipline and he will get that over time especially playing in Utah for Jerry Sloan but he, he's a transition athlete he knows how to score and I think he's got a pretty good understanding of how to play he's got an awful lot of potential I think to get better and better because of his athleticism another one of those guys that, that, that's got freaky length to his arms, a 6'11 wingspan for a guy that's 6'6 in height. Well, the, the thing about it, remember, his dad played the game, so you know his basketball IQ is going to be there, the athleticism's there, and again, he's a good fit for Utah because he's a slasher, something they don't really possess. Remember, Darren Williams had a great rookie year for them. If they get the same type of impact from this young man, that's a team that's going to be on the rise. I think it's a really solid pick for Utah, probably not what they had their intentions on initially with how the draft has played out. But again, I don't think they're going to be unhappy with this young man.